The parents of a teenager killed in a car rollover after taking a bushfire detour say someone needs to be held responsible. They've blamed authorities for failing to warn them about the dangerous gravel road. Jamie Freestone is following the inquest into the death of Haley Scott Healy four years ago. Stephen Healy believes better advice from police would have prevented his daughter's death. In all honesty, it, was, it should have happened and you know, they, they really do think someone should pay for it. 19-year-old Hayley Scott Healy was sleeping on the back seat of her parents' car when her mother lost control on the gravel Norseman Hyden Road. The station wagon rolled and landed on its roof 15 metres off the track. The family was on its way back to Perth from Kalgoorlie and had been forced to take a detour because of the Barabin bushfires, which had already claimed the lives of three truck drivers. Drivers. The Healy's were planning to take the sealed road detour via Esperance, but were told about the shorter alternative at the Tourist Bureau. So we didn't know anything existed. We were taking advice off the uh, tourist information place. Today, the deputy coroner heard there had been a six-fold increase in the number of cars using the unsealed road because of the fires. But investigating officer Mark Matthews testified even with 600 cars using it daily, there was no defect in the road that would have caused the vehicle to lose control. Senior Constable Cassandra Gunn attended the crash scene and told the court the track was one of the best gravel roads she'd driven on. The officer said she'd earlier set up a random breath test outside the Norseman police station in the morning and had been encouraged by her superior to tell people about the sealed road Esperance detour. But she said every motorist she spoke with was happy to take the Hyden track. Well, he could have sat by the road. He could have put his vehicle by the beginning of the road and no one had done that. You know, then it's, a, it's your choice then, you know. But if you don't go past the police station, the place you don't know. The Healy's are considering suing the government. No, she's had something about it, really. But imagine. Jamie Freestone, 10 News.